The outside of Margaret's house displays her love for the royal family. But when you step through the door and see how vast her royal memorabilia collection is, it's evident just how much she loves the monarchy. Every possible space is filled with photos, mugs and ornaments displaying various royals. Lots of stuff in my collection. You know, people have come round and tried to sort of... Um, account for it but there's so much here you know uh, there's a room at the top of the house there's a, a uh, her majesty's room in there the diana room there you know what i mean there's lots they can uh it takes a long time my interest is all about the royal family i just absolutely love anything that comes from them the the shop in uh, in london anywhere that there's anything royal i'm there Margaret met the late Queen and has been to countless royal events in the past, but this year she'll be watching the coronation from home. Ah, on the day of the coronation, drinking lots of tea, definitely, getting up early, don't want to miss anything, just sort of get comfy, keep on drinking cups of tea. <laughs> he was something like eight or nine when he was told that he would be king one day. Well, it's been an awful long wait, hasn't it? So I hope it all goes well. And I think I think it's warming up now. It was sort of quiet a couple of weeks ago. Not much was happening. But now somehow people are getting a bit more excited about it. You can feel it, can't you? You know. The devoted royal fan once met the future king. So I met him on one occasion. Um, they used to have a flower show every year and I went to it. And my little corgi I had with me. And um, he, he said, oh, he's nice. I like him, you know. <laughs> I mean, it's not a real one. But... Very nice. That is, isn't it? Yeah, God save the king. God save the king. Although Margaret's collection is already so impressive, she's planning her next trip into central London to buy more items featuring King Charles III. Lisa Hartle, GB News, London.